Let's get started into our lesson. Here we see the life cycle, as I've described before. The life cycle is the cycle of life. It's how something grows into an adult and then dies and then comes back and grows again. Life all around us is going through this cycle. We can see examples of babies. We can see examples of, of teenagers, for example, middle part. And we can see examples in the middle part of a life. And then we see uh, examples of things that die. This is all part of the life cycle. It's the series of changes. The series of changes occurring in an animal or plant. Like I said, all life goes through a series of changes in uh, the life cycle. Okay, what we are also going to start off with the very beginning of the life cycle for a plant. What is that? Remember in lesson one we talked about the seed and I said we would talk more about that later. It's very important. Well, that's what we're talking about now. The seed is a very important part of the life cycle. The seed is the small part of a plant. Remember what makes the seed? That's right, fruit. Inside the fruit we have seeds. So the seed is a small part of a plant from which a new plant may be grown. So the fruit that contains seeds, when we eat it, or the fruit is carried along by something else, like an animal, they open up, the seeds fall out, and then they will grow again. Some, uh, in many cases, of course, human beings will take the seeds and we will uh, put them in the ground to make them grow. A seedling, when we put the seed in the ground, after a while, if we give it uh, good ground or soil and we give it some water, what happens? A very small plant starts to grow. That is called a seedling. You guys, practice. Seedling. Seedling. A seedling is a very young plant, like a baby plant, that comes out from a seed. It's a very small uh, a plant that comes out. It's really amazing if you have time and you can watch it, but usually we don't have that kind of time. It takes some time, but if we use a video, a special video technique, and we take a picture once every once in a while, then we put it all together. It's very amazing to watch a seedling grow from a seed. Let's take a look. We have a video. Okay, see here we have many different seeds in the ground. Wow, look at that. They're growing up like little seedlings. So we have the time uh, through this photography, you know, that it's not, it doesn't grow this fast, of course. This video is taken over a long period of time and speed it up so that we can see how these seeds will grow and they will make little seedlings. They will sprout up through the ground. It's really amazing, isn't it? Okay, so what we saw there, uh, like the word that I used, sprout, right? Uh, we're using this word as a verb, right? I said these seeds will sprout up. Right now, we can imagine there's a seed under the ground here, and this seedling is sprouting up through the dirt. So if a plant sprouts, new leaves begin to grow on it. So basically, what's, it, what's happening is this seedling is growing up, and it starts to put out leaves right away. Okay, very quickly, because leaves are a very important part of the plant. Okay, now it's very important that the seed is protected, right? Uh, if the seed needs to have some kind of shell or coat around it to protect it from the elements, to protect it from insects, for example, a seed coat covers and protects a seed. So you can see it's been taken away here. This part is the seed coat. Normally, it covers the whole seed, but this seed is about to grow. So it looks like it broke off. It's going to start growing now. But if you take a look at the apple, you open up the apple, you've got the small dark brown seeds. That actually, that dark brown coloring is the coat of the seed. And this is a different kind of seed here, but it's the seed coat. It's like you put on a coat to protect yourself. That's exactly what this is here, a seed coat. A cone is uh, where some the seeds will grow. Now this is a special kind of cone, right? 
You see these in the fall and especially in the winter. If you go into the forest, into a pine forest, there are many pine trees around uh, in Korea. If you go into the forest like uh, maybe some of the national parks like Soraksan, Woraksan, Chidisan, right? You can see all of these uh, different cones on the ground and they're lying around. These are pine cones and inside the cone there are little seeds. So a cone that has many seeds is the fruit of the pine tree. So it's strange to think that this is fruit, isn't it? Of course you wouldn't eat that. <laughs> oh, it would be terrible and also it would, it would hurt your mouth. But this is the type of fruit that a pine tree grows. So we don't eat the fruit of a pine tree, right? We eat the fruit of an apple tree or a lemon tree. But we don't eat the fruit of a pine tree. But it's still a kind of fruit. And this is the kind of fruit that a pine tree produces. And like we saw, inside the fruit are seeds. So this is a type of fruit as well. Interesting. An adult. We've talked about the seed, we've talked about the seedling, and after a long time, we have an adult. And of course, a tree takes a very, very long time to grow. Some trees are hundreds of years old, right? If you can imagine that. An adult, an adult means fully grown. So if it's an adult plant, if it's an adult dog, or if it's an adult human being, it means it is fully grown. It's in uh, the final stage of growth. It's fully grown. Lesson 2 Life Cycle of a Plant Life Cycle a life cycle is the series of changes occurring in an animal or plant. Seed A seed is the small part of a plant from which a new plant may grow. Seedling A seedling is a young plant that grows out from a seed. Sprout If a plant or seed sprouts, New leaves begin to grow on it. Seed coat. A seed coat covers and protects a seed. Cone. A cone that has many seeds is the fruit of the pine tree. Adult. Adult means fully grown.